we have executed 352 MOUs with an investment commitment of over 13 lakhs 5,663 crores and an employment potential of over 6 lakh 3,223 to offer. In the energy sector alone, 40 MOUs have been signed worth 8 lakh 24,823 crores of investment creating an employment potential of 1,90,000 families. In the IT and ITES sector, 56 MOUs were also signed, amounting to 25,587 crores of investment with an employment potential of 1,4,442 people. In the tourism sector, another 117 MOUs have been signed and the investment to the tune of 22,000 crores with an employment potential of 30,787 people. I wish to point out that one of the, one of the sectors into which significant investments were committed is the renewable energy sector. These proposed investments into renewable energy generation, pump storage, and production of green hydrogen and green ammonia would go a long way in mitigating the intermittency associated with renewable energy and render it a credible alternative to fossil fuel-based generation. This would make a significant contribution in green energy space to India's commitment towards achieving net zero. I'm thankful to you all I'm thankful for your trust and faith in Andhra Pradesh and in our government especially. I sincerely request all of you to move from the MOU stage to grounding of your investments in Andhra Pradesh at the earliest. We are committed to facilitate speedy and hassle-free conversion of these MOUs signed into actual investments. To enable this, we are forming a monetary committee consisting of the Chief Secretary himself and the CMO officials together with the Special Chief Secretary Industries. This committee will meet every week and closely follow up on the implementation of these MOUs. This committee will sort out all the day-to-day -day issues faced by you and will facilitate the speedy grounding of these investments. Assuring you all that our government will demonstrate our speed of facilitating business as well. Today we have also witnessed the inauguration of 14 industrial houses with an, indus with an investment of approximately 3,841 crores and an employment which has been generated to the extent of 9,108 jobs. In fact, it gives me great pride to do these inaugurations online. This reflects the implementation mindset of, the, of our government for grounding and facilitating your investments in the state. And I wish you all the very best as you commence your journey forward, assuring you that you will find an environment that welcomes you, that guides you, provides you access to enabling infrastructure and skilled manpower, mitigating the risks associated with your business and effectively rendering your investments mutually rewarding to both you and the state of Andhra Pradesh. I once again thank you all for the trust reposed in the state of Andhra Pradesh and making this event 
a phenomenal success. Thank you once again.